A massive spring nor'easter is spinning over the northeast this morning with flooding rains and damaging winds. Now, the worst of that rain has fallen from the Carolinas all the way on up through to Canada. Some areas on the storm's western edge are seeing a healthy dose of heavy, wet snow. Seth Doan is in one of those places, Johnstown, Pennsylvania, this morning. Seth, good morning. That's right. Good morning, Erica. There are already several inches of snow on the ground here in parts of Johnstown and more, much more expected throughout the day. Upwards of a foot or snow predicted in this region. That's creating a snow day, a very unusual late April snow day as there are a number of school closings across the region. That means fewer buses, school buses on the road, but also in some cases fewer plows. You had such a mild winter and mild spring that people took plows off of their trucks. They're certainly putting those plows back on trucks today in parts of western Pennsylvania, also Ohio, and through parts of western New York in areas like Buffalo. They're expected to see many inches of snow today. Further east, the real problem in this storm is rain, flooding, localized flooding trapped some motorists in Jersey City. They needed tow trucks to get free of that localized flooding. It's likely to be a messy, soggy, wet commute up and down the eastern seaboard today. Here, temperatures are, are hovering around freezing, which means it's a very dense, wet snow, and it's really sticking to the trees and branches, creating concerns for widespread power outages. Back to you folks. Just what you want on April 23rd. Seth, thanks. CBS This Morning, Saturday weather anchor Lonnie Quinn is tracking the nor'easter for us. Lonnie, good morning. And good morning, Erica. Good morning, everybody. Let's take a look at what this storm looks like right now in the satellite and radar picture. I want you to know this much. Come tomorrow at lunchtime. Who's ever being affected by the storm, it's going to be out of here. Tomorrow by lunchtime, we dust our hands of it. But as of right now, this is the snow we were just showing you with Seth's picture. Anywhere from portions of, well, I'll say western New York, all through western Pennsylvania, into portions of West Virginia. If we can zoom in now and show you how much snow we are expecting out of this, it looks like this center swath will see over a half a foot. But zoom in even tighter. Between Buffalo and Erie, it looks like portions will be seeing about 14 inches of snow. And you heard from Seth, the probable of power lines coming down because those tree limbs are going to snap. It's a heavy wet snow with all those leaves. They hold an extra heavy amount of snow and consequently the heavy winds will just be snapping it while rain as well. Again, some portions picking up over three inches. All right, Erica, Charlie, over to you guys. All right, Lonnie, thanks. Nice to see you this morning.